We paid a guy. Yeah. <laughs> there was a, actually a former employee here that maybe sold me something that said it was from a doctor, but I ended up getting it tested, and it was <laughs> definitely not from a doctor. Yes. And could have gotten me hooked on drugs. but uh, And it could have also been laced with fentanyl. Yeah, luckily. You didn't. The old <laughs> noggin. <laughs> Okay, so for today's video, I saw this post on the subreddit, the Fight of the Kids subreddit, about Mark Harley. Now, if you guys remember Mark Harley, Brendan Schaub's old uh, friend, now <laughs> bitter enemies, maybe, you know, somewhat on the on Mark Harley's side, um, for very good reasons, you know, lack of pay, getting fired pretty badly. Uh, Mark Harley leaked some alleged text uh, between him and Brendan about Adderall and also the baddies, which is um, allegedly as well. Now, this clip here, uh, for context, I guess, uh, they're, they're talking about like hackers and I think specifically Brendan was talking about this guy that got sent to jail because of the Silk Road. They, they talked about the Silk Road and how they could, you know, buy drugs online. What's like that kid who came up with the developed right. the Silk Road, basically the the dark web? He's in prison for like forty years. It's like, nah, man. Instead of throwing this kid in the can, oh. use this. Yeah, he's it, it, he's what, brilliant. What, that so, guy, he's a beast. So what is this? He Silk Road is where you can exchange like basically drugs. And then Nick mentions the guy here. So he's the producer of the Golden Hour. He talks about uh, a time when a certain person that used to work with them got him some drogas right and so what he says is that that person gave him some drogas that were tainted but yeah he starts talking about them and i think it's kind of messed up you know it's uh you're talking about a guy who's not there anymore and you know these guys you know uh brendan and, and mark went through a, a bunch of things and you know last thing you want to do is try to you know rile him up because you know mark has been has been very vocal about his dislike towards brendan what's up brother um decided to send you a voice note decided not to text you i don't you know for a few reasons um i don't know man i've, I've been contemplating whether hitting you back up um you seem really upset obviously uh, i'm hurt man if you want to hurt me you got me brother you definitely got me. Um, I don't understand it. I don't. I still consider your friend. Uh, it's it's weird. I'm I'm not even mad. I'm not I'm not even mad. You know. I'm not even mad. I'm not. I don't know why it's weird. I'm not mad. I'm just hurt, man. I'm sad about it. Um, you're a friend, man. You're a really good friend. You don't have a ton of friends. Um, it is what it is. I hope you're doing okay, brother. I hope you're doing uh, Once upon a time, they were best friends and all that. So you can see that he does not care anymore about dropping some receipts on them. So let's watch this clip of uh, Nick talking about a certain someone here. <laughs> yeah. There was a, actually a former employee here that maybe sold me something that said it was from a doctor, but I ended up getting it tested and it was definitely not from a doctor yes and could have gotten me hooked on drugs but uh, and it could also been laced with fentanyl yeah luckily you didn't the <laughs> old noggin yeah. luckily you didn't. fool nick once it's shame on me it's not just a hat rack yeah. so yeah that's that's uh certain somebody right certain someone gave him that and and yes nick does not look good right now he's got a black eye uh, i don't know he, did he get beat up or something did he get jumped i forgot but yeah he does not look good he doesn't seem very trustworthy but when i was a little suspicious of it uh, just because of how it looked it, it was supposed to be adderall okay. and i was suspicious of it because it like the color did not look the same and i looked up on chat gbt i was like how can i get drugs tested in la oh. and there's an lgbtq center that once a month they put up a pop-up van and you can just bring your drugs to be tested. So. Did you have to act gay? Uh, no. I tried to act normal and like make jokes. I was like, While oh, this is like a the drugs. Nick's all, <laughs> <laughs> Nick's all, hey. How I long is this going to take? <laughs> Guys, I also don't condone drug use uh, any way, shape, or, for or form. YouTube, please know that I am not trying to, I guess, uh, make this kind of thing, you know, cool or anything. I do not want to do that.
I advise you, please do not get anything that you don't know about from a stranger or from the dark web, especially. And good thing for Nick that he actually did go and test it out. Good on, good one on Nick. Just <laughs> give him props on, on one thing, you know, out of this whole video. Wow. Okay, he so you tested him. the drugs, and what did come what back was in it? And, and so they they test for fentanyl, yeah. amphetamine, and methamphetamine, and Adderall should only have amphetamine. Right. Uh, and it tested negative for fentanyl, positive for amphetamine. And then I was like, I was trying to joke with them. I was like, this is like a paternity test. Yeah. Like, I would get back. And they just thought it was some drug act, so they didn't laugh. And then it tested positive for methamphetamine. Whoa. Wow. Yeah. So and you're about to take I was out. I was out 400 bucks. Yeah. <laughs> 400 oh, bucks. did you? And did you ask the guy? Were you like, hey, man, this isn't. This is math. I asked for Adderall. Yeah. And he goes, same thing. There you go. So let's get to BGL, Mark Harley's response towards this. And this is what he said here, because he, he actually commented and he said, this is really Mark Harley's uh, account. And he, and he said, aw, I'm disappointed, Nick. This story never happened. You never texted me anything about meth. You bought a couple of pills you knew came off the dark web. Then you were fiending for more two weeks later. But since I wasn't working at Thick Boy anymore and didn't need to have literally hundreds of Adderall on hand for Brendan's unsatiable I put you in contact with a dealer and we never spoke again. Sucks. I have to post our text now. Oh, a little bit of a, a little bit of a threat there. Some guy says, sucks. I have to post our I have to post our text now. BGL got the receipts. Oops. Uh everybody's saying BGL cook that boy Nick. Uh oh really, dude. I don't know. I haven't seen those. I don't think he's posted the receipts. Uh, I think he's just kind of kidding around here, but yeah. And funny enough, uh this actually comes up when uh, Brandon was at the fight companion with Joe Rogan and he talked about when he finally got off of it and he slightly mentioned where he got it from and he said it from the dark web. So here's that clip. Um, it's probably been over two months now. Okay. How long were you doing it for? Over a year. Oh my God. I can see it on every day. Why'd you start? Oh my God, over a I year. I like to party. <laughs> did, you go to a, did you go to a doctor? And... <laughs> Child taking nights. <laughs> Did you go to a doctor and they like for psychiatric nah, help? The, no, uh, he doesn't go to the web. doctor. Dark web. There you go. Don't do that. Don't say it. There you go. Let's hear that again. Did you go to a doctor <laughs> and they like for psychiatric nah, help? It, uh, no, he doesn't dark go to the web. doctor. Dark web. Don't. There you go. I don't know. You guys can connect the things together. Maybe. I don't know. More, formulate your own opinion. Let me know down below. I thought it was kind of interesting. Um, you know, they're trying to really make uh mark harley look like a really really bad guy i mean i mean <laughs> i mean we we, we kind of already saw that you know previously during his oh little saga but this is uh adding on to the to the pile on that we forgot about so yeah let me know about what you guys think about this um i know mark if he's gonna be here eventually on the comment section uh let me know about what you guys think about this uh see you guys next time like and subscribe uh bye bye, -bye. yeah